Hi, this is Russell Kirkland, and this is Simple Unity 3D. Today I'm going to show you how to create your basic playing field, which is the beginning for getting your game started using Unity. First thing you want to do is open Unity, and then go ahead and say Create New Project, and you'll come to this screen here. I'm going to go ahead and just call my new project, Test and right here I get a choice of what um, packages I want to import. A package is basically software um, that you'll use within Unity that will help you to do certain things. If you don't import them during the package uh, project creation, you will still be able to import them at any time during your creation or working within your project. So you don't have to worry about whether you imported them or not in the beginning. You'll always have an option to import in the future. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, import character controller. Um, and I'm going to say uh, uh, create. I'll call it test2. I didn't let me create, create test because I already had one called test. So I'm going to create test2 and I'm going to say create. It'll go ahead and uh, start loading up Unity, creating my project, adding the things in that I need. I'll come to the welcome screen. I'm going to go ahead and close the uh, welcome to Unity screen. And here I am at my basic window within Unity. You can change the way windows are by going up to the right hand corner and clicking here and you can change the display uh, the way Unity shows you the panels. I uh, kind of like the four split which gives you different views of what your theme is going to look like. Um, a top view, uh, perspective view which is uh, more along the lines of what the game will actually look like, a front view, right view, or you can change that uh, to left view, back view, those type of views. As you work with the game um, and the idea of 3D modeling, you'll, uh, you'll learn what those different views mean. But I'm going to go ahead and within this top panel here, go ahead and create my playing field. In this case, all I'm going to do is go up to Game Object, Create Other, and I'm going to create a plane. Uh, you could create a cube, a spear, a capsule, cylinder, um, any one of those and make it uh, to be your playing field. I'm going to go ahead and just create a plane. And at this point, a plane shows up. Now, when this plane is uh, highlighted or selected, you'll see it in this panel right here and it will be called plane. You can rename this if you wanted to, but I'm going to go ahead and just keep it plane. When you click plane, your inspector panel will tell you details about plane. By the way, if your inspector panel for some reason is not showing up, you could always go to window and make whatever panels you need to show up by clicking on them within window. Uh, so under inspector, I like to do my scaling um, under the inspector window. So I'm going to go ahead and scale this. I'll give it a 3 for X, um, a 3 for Y, and a 3 for Z. And you'll see that it gets much bigger um, as I change the scaling. So you can play with that scaling to determine how big your playing field is going to be. Um, so at this point, if I were to uh, want to play the game, I know I'm not going to be able to do much, but if I want to play the game, I would be able to do so, um, or at least see the game by clicking on this uh, play button right here. At that point, it, this lower left hand game window will show me what the game looks like at this point. This gray area down here is the plane that I just created. Up here would be uh, the equivalent to us uh, to what the sky is. So at this point, you have made at least the playing field. Now you would start to put your objects and controllers and all the things that are going to make your game work on top of that. But to get started, you need to start with your playing field. 
That's it for today. Um, please join me for future ones as I go over the basics and uh, trying to explain Unity 3D in simple terms. Thank you.